Luis Suarez was in tears on Saturday after his goal helped Atletico Madrid clinch the Spanish Liga title, thanking the club for rescuing him and proving how bad Barcelona's decision to let him leave at the beginning of the season was. Hey guys, we talk football here, and today we look at why Barcelona were wrong in selling Luis Suarez. Suarez actually looks set to leave on a free to Juventus, having reportedly been told by Barcelona's incoming boss Ronald Koeman that he was no longer wanted. It was only after the deal to Juve fell through and Barca realized their star striker joining Atletico Madrid for no money was a terrible look, so they agreed a minimal fee based on set targets. The transfer fee with add-ons could only reach 6 million euros, which is 7 million US, which is literally peanuts considering today's transfer market. Barcelona have had a troubled year, with the fallout with Lionel Messi, financial troubles, legal cases and a loss of form. But letting Suarez leave has to rank up there with Barcelona's most retarded decisions ever. This is a player who scored 198 goals in just 6 seasons at the Catalan club, and even last year when he had struggles with injury, he managed a very decent return of 21 goals in 36 games. He was also just 33 years old when Barca decided he wasn't worth of a place in their squad. Which is quite ironic considering Barca are reportedly signing 33 year old Sergio Aguero. Moreover, Suarez is a player who thrives on proving people wrong. He's never more motivated than when he feels the world is against him, and now he's proved it once again, but in Atletico's red and white stripes rather than Barcelona's blue and maroon. How did this just hold on? Oh, I'm not having this. I'm what, not having what, what, this. No, 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 no. Whether the fault lies with Komen, with former president Jose Maria Bartomeu, or can be shared among a collection of individuals, it's safe to say pushing a modern day club legend out of the door and into the arms of one of your biggest rivals is an absolute disaster of a decision. Back in October, it looked like a crazy decision to let Suarez go, no matter his age, several months later and it looks even worse. Suarez was instrumental in helping Atletico Madrid capture their first La Liga title in quite some time. The former Barcelona star scored in Atletico's 2-1 victory over Real Valladolid on Saturday to ensure his side lifted the La Liga trophy. After the 2-1 win at Valladolid, Suarez was overcome by an outpouring of emotion that brought together the joy of victory and the satisfaction of having made Barcelona regret his exit. The Uruguayan spoke about his troubled exit from Barcelona last summer, saying that the situation I experienced last summer was difficult, the way I was underestimated. Atletico Madrid opened up their doors to me to keep on showing the player I am. Suarez this season netted 21 times while providing 3 assists in the league for Atletico. And with that being said, there's no doubt in my mind that Suarez was indeed the X factor in this year's La Liga title race. Without Suarez this season, I don't think Atletico Madrid would win the league. Barcelona's rumored interest in Aguero just also proves that they know it was a mistake selling Suarez. In fact, if Barcelona didn't sell Luis Suarez, they probably would have won the league this year. Suarez said he had not received any messages from Komen or Bartomeu congratulating him for firing Atletico to their first La Liga title since 2014, although he joked he was close to sending them a photo after winning his fifth league in seven years in Spain. Ultimately, Barcelona's big mistake was Atletico's perfect gift. Suarez has given Atletico a leadership they have lacked since that title seven years ago when they had characters like Diego Godin and Gabi in the team. Luis Suarez has proved he can score goals without Messi. He has formed new partnerships with Angel Correa and Marcus Llorente, bringing the best out of those to, just as he arguably brought the best out of Daniel Sturridge and Raheem Sterling while at Liverpool. But let us know what you guys think. Is Barcelona's decision to let their former striker go to a title rival the worst transfer decision ever? Please be sure to like, subscribe, and share, and we'll see you guys on the next one.